Hello, this is Father Michael Hannison, um, pastor at St. Joachim Catholic Church in Costa Mesa, California. Well, we haven't been online in quite a while. Our director of communication got married. What's more important, getting married or doing my, uh, in case you missed it? Well, we know the truth to that. The reason why what I want to talk about today is that uh, next week I won't be on because, well, to tell you the truth, we priests, uh, Father Miguel Angel and myself, are going on a pilgrimage in the East Coast to various locations associated with American saints, such as St. Kateri Tekawitha, whose feast day I think is tomorrow. Also, uh, Isaac Jogues and um, John Brebeuf uh, and their companions, several Jesuit missionaries in the uh, 17th century who died at the hands of um, the indigenous tribes of those of the Northeast. And then also uh, Elizabeth Ann Seaton, St. John Neumann, Catherine Drexel, uh, so many saints that are that we have here in the United States that many of us don't even know existed. So we're taking a bunch of young people, teenagers, on this trip for them to, as a way for them to get hands-on with what is so beautiful in our Catholic faith, which is, of course, the saints, as a way of encouraging them to strive for uh, holiness in their own lives, that they themselves may one day be saints, <clears throat> those who are holy ones in the eyes of God. It's also interesting in these kinds of pilgrimages that we do a vocation call and we ask young people to consider a vocation to the priesthood or to religious life. It's funny in the past that uh, Father Douglas Avala, who was once at St. Joachim's, and as well as uh, Father um, Randy Guillen and Father Miguel um, Angel, all went on pilgrimages early in their life and stood up for a vocation and they went to the seminary, got ordained priests, and they've all served here at St. Joachim. So we're hoping to stimulate a vocation call as well. So while we are gone, we leave uh, on late in the evening for an all-nighter, a, a red-eye flight to uh, Buffalo, New York, to start our pilgrimage. Uh, and then I'll be back on the 27th, and during that time, I will certain, certainly include the intentions of St. Joachim parishioners in our masses and in our prayer. And I invite you to pray for, for us as well, especially our young people, that they would have an open heart to follow um, a call by God to be a Christian, to be a Catholic, to be holy, and maybe possibly to embrace um, the religious life or the priesthood. Thank you very much. Pray for us. You will be in my prayers.